Hello po mga kababayan. Hello teman-teman. Sawadika. Xin chào các bạn. Hello and welcome to NIA Global News. I am your English news reporter Angela. The National Immigration Agency reminds the public to avoid crowded areas as local cases continue to rise. The ASEAN Plaza in Taichung will be closed temporarily. Migrant workers invest in an AI chatbot capable of speaking four languages to assist in epidemic prevention. New immigrants have a chance to win a grand prize in an online tour guide competition. The National Immigration Agency reminds the public to avoid crowded areas as local cases continue to rise. To prevent the outbreak from getting worse, the staff of the NIA went to visit areas where migrant workers gathered. They distributed the safety, quarantine, and prevention project and multilingual epidemic confirmation. This is to remind new immigrants and migrant workers to refrain from going out and participating in religious gatherings. The NIA makes use of its multi-channel publicity to prevent the spread of the virus. The ASEAN Plaza in Taichung will be closed temporarily. Once the national level 3 alert was implemented, confirmed cases originating from the ASEAN Plaza in Taichung began to rise. Taichung City Government announced that businesses in the ASEAN Plaza will be closed until June 14. The mayor of Taichung City thanked the different companies for paying attention to public safety and for cooperating with epidemic prevention policies. Everybody is cooperating in preventing the spread of the virus. Migrant workers invest in an AI chatbot capable of speaking four languages to assist in epidemic prevention. The epidemic situation in Taiwan is worsening, and there are currently 700,000 migrant workers in the country. Therefore, migrant workers play an important role in fighting the epidemic. 140, a public welfare organization, aims to raise awareness of epidemic prevention measures among migrant workers. With 140, daily news is provided in four languages, Filipino, Indonesian, Vietnamese, and Thai. This is to unite migrant workers and Taiwanese locals in fighting the epidemic together. New immigrants have a chance to win a grand prize in an online tour guide competition. To introduce the native culture of migrant workers to local Taiwanese, New Immigrants Development Information Networks hosts the New Immigrants Creative Competition. Participants must write articles or film videos about the culture of their native countries. The first place winner will receive a 32-inch LCD screen TV. 